Sunday started with media day here at Florida State. Welcome to the Moore Athletic Center, everyone. I'm Scott Kodak for Seminoles.com. One of the great things about media day is it brings out a little bit of a happier side, a more joyful side of the players and coaches. Today, it really all is about having fun, getting to take the team picture, going over to fan day, enjoying an open practice. But the one great thing about media day is some very fun things the players said. Take a listen at the best they had to say. Do you, do you have the best beard on the team? Heck yeah, are you kidding me? <laughs> Is there anyone who could tell you who could possibly? Hopefield's trying. He's got like a little Abe Lincoln, but he can't grow a stash. And uh, another guy could grow a beard on the O-line. It used to be Mendel. Like Mendel had a good beard. I can only think of maybe Spurlock. And he's a GA, but he's got that, that, that uh, Q-tip beard going on, the blonde one. But, uh, you know, the beards just kind of happen, and I'm, I think I'm going to keep it the whole season. Every day we go into the practice with our team, man. We got our team, like, we get the same reps. Everything is going smooth. We got everybody in that thing. I mean, when we got guys around us, like it don't matter. We can have Johnny Two Shoes at quarterbacks. We got the guys we got at O line and Rob receiver. Going local, uh, it's kind of something I came up with. You know, uh, it's just, you know, it kind of explains like my adrenaline. You know, the way I feel on the field. You know, after making a big play, you know, uh, it's just the excitement. You know, I just love the game. We're at Christmas. There's some new things out there. I want to learn them. Hey, maybe this can help me. I like what we did before, and we're going to use that. And there's a few little – I get a few extra toys at Christmas here that I can play with. Offensively, new, new uh, roles, new development, things we're doing that are differently on offense. You know, we got a new quarterback, so we got a new leader. So I think it's helped the focus of the other guys knowing, let me do, make sure I do my job so these young guys can get comfortable. And uh, I, it, it, I think they're feeding off each other. One, two, three. Last one for me. One, two, three. Don't move. <laughs> like this. You gotta go slow. <laughs> so it's all about going slow? Yeah, you gotta you gotta go slow. You gotta you can't go too fast. Is that but is there gonna be another celebration like that this year? No. It's always gonna be this. It's always gonna be that. With all these veterans, man, it makes everyone's job easier having everybody back and having everybody had these opportunities and had last year they showed what they can do and just having them back man it's a blessing. Florida State will return to practice on Monday for their very first two a day of fall camp and of course Seminoles.com will again have the most complete coverage you can find online. So here on Sunday afternoon at the Moore Athletic Center I'm Scott Kodak for Seminoles.com.